How did uh, Volquez look, especially after a bit of a tough first inning? You know, he looked good, but even even the tough first inning wasn't wasn't really his fault. They didn't really hit anything hard. Uh, we kind of misplayed one ball, and even though they had three hits, none of them were hit hard. So I, he, he pitched well. And a bit of bad luck, I guess, as far as the, later on with the error and the... Yeah, and the error's just a bad hop. It, I mean, it, it's it's a play Valenka makes all the time and took a bad hop and came up on him and, you know... That's, uh, you, you got to try to overcome that stuff. Um, what happened as far as the ejection there? Uh, just uh, not agreeing with the call on No, no, it wasn't a, I, I disagreed with why, why and how he threw him out. Uh, I, I mean, that's basically the calls, no. Uh, you know, I thought there was some stuff all night. You know, I wasn't happy. I that wasn't, the, I hadn't been sitting there all night. I'd been on him a little bit all night, so... Uh, I didn't like the way he threw Hermita out of the game. I, I didn't think it was necessary. He interpreted something I don't think Hermita said, and I was as close to Hermita as he was. So quite frankly, you know, it's it's not like he was standing there. And for a suggestion of the year? Well, I don't get too many. I've gone a couple years without getting them, so I don't like to get tossed. That's not, I just don't believe in that. What about uh, Corky? What was the thought as far as uh, putting him at uh, first uh, today? Trying to get his bat in the lineup. Uh -huh. I mean, basically, you know, I'm looking for somebody to step up and, and get some hits, yes. and I thought Corky would be the man off the left hand. Um, how do you look just playing first? I know it's been a while since It's been a while, and, and you know, he had the one play and, and made the play, and, and that ball came up on him. Mm -hmm. I mean, that was a bad hop, but, you know, one thing about Corky, he's a good catcher. He's going to square the ball up and take it off the chest, and that's... You know, the ball came up and he took it. Thanks, Skip. You got it. Uh, what do you got for me? I got, I want to ask uh, about Christopher Negron. Made a great play on that double play at yep. short. We've seen it all year. He's just been full of just highlight reel kind of plays. But we see him have some mental errors on the uh, the easy ones. Is it just a focus thing with him? That It's very typical of a lot of young players. Uh, he is getting better. Knock on wood at the routine plays. We have really focused on that. That's what we've talked about. I love the great plays, but I want the routine plays. Any manager in baseball is going to tell you uh, the great plays are fine. I love them, but I want every routine. That's why we love Cozart. That's why we love Yanis. Uh, that's why we love Valleca. You, if the ground ball was hit to short, you, you dropped your head and started writing it up. It was an out. Uh, you know, and, and Chris. Had to learn that. Had mm -hmm. to learn that that was what's important. And he's getting better. Uh, speaking of like us hitting really well, still, what kind of adjustments did he make to you know get him where he's at? Well, you know? I, I think you know I, I think the biggest thing is I really we try to get him to focus on the success he was having earlier. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I kind of got away from his game a little bit, which was looking for fastballs, driving the ball more up the middle. He got he got started looking at it a little bit too much away. I think. Uh, you know, and, and getting his pitch, whether it was early in the count or late in the count. Got a lot, a lot of the team, you know, has been, you know, I guess moved up. So you got a lot of new players in right now, not the team you started out with. From here on out, what would you determine as a successful season? Well, I think the biggest thing, you know, I, what I look to do right now, and which I've done the last three or four years, even though we've won the mm -hmm. division three years in a row, what I'm looking to do right now is get a lot of these young guys ready for next year. Uh, you know, I'm, I hope to be back here next year. And if I'm back here next year, I want to make sure that, that these guys are ready to play and open the season. So a lot of what I'm doing now is with these young guys is seeing who I want to play next year here and, and getting them ready to play here the way I want them to play.